Hello everyone. In this mini series, I'm going to create a tic tac toe game uh, in multiplayer mode or two players mode. And for that, I'm going to use Python version 3.6.5 and Pygame version 1.9.4. So the application will look like this. We are going to have a server.py a client.py and also a grid.py and to make it easier to run uh, this game I am created two batch files server.bat and client.bat so let me take a look let me show you how the, how the end product will look like so I'm going to run the server.bat and it opens up a Pygame window with the title tic-tac-toe server and also with the grid. And now let's run the client.bat and after after I instantiated a client uh, application on the server side it just shows that the client is connected and the communication is done between two windows between these two windows using the sockets library and uh, uh, TCP networking so after I click on the server side it just sends to the client through TCP sockets that hey this uh, cell was clicked so on the client side it also draws in the first cell the X so let me click on the client it draws an O and it also sends through TCP to the server that hey you should draw an O in this position so let's click another for the server and another for the client and as you can see the communication between these two instances of the application is um, is going as it should so and when I finish a row on the server side it prints to the console that X wins and of course after after X wins, the application is, uh, you can no more click on the application, but you can press the space, it clears out the grid, also on the server, press the space, clear, clears out the grid, and the game starts over. So now, the next uh, turn is, so you can not click on the server, because the next turn is on, uh, is on the client, or the client. So now let make uh, win the client. So and here on the client's console, it prints that O wins. So this will be the end product I'm going to create in this mini series. In the first few videos, I'm going to create the game uh, in single player mode. After that, when the single player mode works, I'm going to rearrange and refactor the code so that it will uh, it will involve TCP sockets and also multi-threading.